The Bio to What initiative is the first commercially viable biogas electricity project in South Africa and will bring you renewable energy to BMW plant in Roslyn in Pretoria, some 30 kilometers away. We're using 12 megawatts per hour through the plant and this program, this project we've put together, will take about 4 megawatts of that per hour. So this is significant, 25 to 30 percent of our energy usage will come via this plant here. So instead of having one energy plant, we've now got 25,000 of them behind us. It's been a long road for the founder, which started in 2005, before the renewable energy program got off the ground in South Africa. He's using adapted technology and some foreign equipment. We're evacuating our baseload power of around 2 megawatts at the moment. Because we're still in commissioning phase, we're switching on the engines, generating the power, and then at times switching them off again. And so it's a typical commissioning phase, but we are generating power, we are putting it into the grid, the, the electrons are flowing. The manufacturing plant needs lots of power, and the biogas plant won't be able to meet all those needs. We know that this won't be the only project we need to work with. Uh, we want to get to 100% renewables by 2020. We're talking to the city of Schwane about methane gas through the landfill site. That could certainly probably do the rest for us as well. So between the two projects, we could become totally so sustainable by 2020. There are plans to expand the biogas project. There is only one limiting factor once they're at full production. There is a possibility as well, if we're consistently getting more feedstock than what we require, uh, to operate 4.4 megawatts, then we, we're initially going to flare. We'll monitor over a period of six months, and then we'll expand the plant. We'll just simply add on engines. The line that we built, uh, the medium voltage line we built, it can take up to 10 or 12 megawatts. Power supply in South Africa is a major concern because of the issues around the power stations, but increasingly more companies are moving to alternative energy sources because they want to become more efficient, and they also want to make less of an impact on the environment. It seems to be working in this case. I'm Angelo Coppola for CCTV in Bronco Sprite.